Hi everyone, how are you? Welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS exam. Here, this is the uh, question here. A 23 years old lady is undergoing a trendyline birth procedure for varicose veins. During the dissection of the saphenofemoral junction, which of the following structures listed below is most liable to injury? So first of all, we have to find out the saphenofemoral junction. That means it is a junction between the femoral vein and saphenous vein. Then we have to find a structure which is closely related to this junction. And here, this is the options. Options are superficial circumflex iliac artery, superficial circumflex iliac vein, femoral artery, femoral nerve, and deep external pudental artery. So we have to find out one of the option which will be answer of this question so here we can see first of all this is the femoral vein and this is the great saphenous vein and here this is the junction point of the femoral vein and great saphenous vein because the great saphenous vein drains into the femoral vein here and now we have to find out the structure which is very closely to this saphenous and femoral vein here we can see a artery which goes below the saphenous vein and this artery is the external pudental artery uh, crossing inferiorly at the fossa obelis this is the external pudental artery so this artery who is passing below the great saphenous vein and above the femoral vein this is the external pudental artery so external pudental artery may be damaged during the dissection of the saphenofemoral femoral junction that means this junction in this picture we can see this is the femoral triangle this triangle this triangle this is the it is the femoral triangle here this is the femoral triangle and different structure in the femoral triangle such as this is the femoral vein femoral artery and femoral nerve and here you can see uh, the femoral artery here drains this vein this is the great saphenous vein and here we can see the artery which passes below the great saphenous vein and this artery is external pudental vessels external pudental artery or deep external pudental artery so it is uh, now uh, clear that the deep external pudental artery this artery which is the deep external pudental artery this deep external pudental artery is very close to the saphenofemoral junction because it passes below this great saphenous vein but in front of the femoral vein and it may be damaged or injured during the dissection for this saphenofemoral junction thank you all